Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Soloing the Ark. I'm Flinger Foo, and uh, you know what? Today, I think that, uh, well, you know, I've been taking a look at Around the Base, and every single time I do anything, stuff comes up, they get attacked, and uh, yeah, and everybody wanders, you know, and it's just, yeah, it's just a whole big thing like that. So, um, yeah, I need to start worrying about moving here soon, because I have been not putting up a uh, wall because I know I'm going to be moving. Those hyenas are so awesome. <laughs> All right, but yeah, I, I haven't been putting up a wall because I know I'm going to be moving here soon. So I just need to, I, I need to hurry up and just move and get this over with. But in order to do that, I need to uh, go uh, get a beaver and a dodicarus. Now, I think on the beaver front, I'm probably going to do that before... I move on the Dodicarus, I'm going to do that after I move. Um, because a Dodicarus, you can't pick up with an Argent. A uh, Beaver, you can. So, and let's just put that meat in there as well. Alright, um, uh, so, yeah, that's kind of the thing. Because, um, whatever I tame now, I have to either carry with a flyer across the island, or I have to march it across the island. Oh, wrong button. Or I have to march it across the island. And if I go get a Dodicarus, I'm not going to be able to march it across the island. And I'm making a whole bunch of this. So let's just get all that gunpowder made. All right, good job. All right, and let's see. What do you guys have on you? I love these guys. These guys are so awesome. All right. Let's see. Uh, pet, pet, and pet. Good job, guys. Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> Let's see, how much spoiled meat do we have in here? Ah, uh, 26, that'll do. Alright, um... Now let's go like this, and then butt spud, I'm gonna put this on you, and then we're gonna go grab a few narco berries after I drop off a few extra things. Yesterday up in the mosh pit, I was able to loot a couple, uh, of these, uh, metal tools, and that's kinda one of the little benefits of stuff, places like the mosh pit, is you can... I'm out of room in there? All right, what all do I have? Oh, I, I've got a bunch of metal in there that needs... Oh, that was from my toilet-making experience. All right, so, uh, yeah, let's just get that... You know what? Let's get that smelted up. All right, what else do we have in here? Um, I've got an extra crossbow. Oh, I've got three crossbows now? How did that happen? All right, so, yeah, I'm going to uh, finish crafting up the rest of this stuff, and then we're going to go out and we're going to go uh, see uh, what levels beavers we can find. All right, and we're going to um, take out uh, Taming Buddy... Butt Spud and the Hyena Pack because I have a feeling that those three right there are going to be I mean the Hyenas, the Ichthyornis, and the Equus are going to be the perfect stuff for just mid-game taming of anything you want being able to survive on the island. So today is going to be kind of a big practice of that. Can we go out on the island and do whatever we want with those with the combination of those guys? I think we can. All right, so hey, I will see you guys in a bit after I'm done uh, crafting up all this stuff. All right, I think we're all set. Um, I got a whole bunch of uh, spark powder and gunpowder crafted up. Got all my stuff situated. Got a couple new things going. Uh, let's close this up. I should probably get some more wood burning in there. But you know what? I'm fine with that. And also, this right here is all the crops that I've uh, been able to get so far. Not too bad. And I have them on her. Um, I don't think she... Increases their spoil time at all, but um, if we're gonna go out and tame a beaver I'm not gonna do it with measure berries, so I'm gonna do it I mean since we don't have gallimimus kibble I'm just gonna do it with uh, Vegetables because that's one of the easiest ways of doing it. Um, it doesn't take as long as measure berries um, It takes a lot longer than gallimimus kibble, but not as long as measure berries So yeah, we've got the taming buddy. We got uh, butt spud. We got the hyena pack we're heading out. All right, now we finally made it over here to the this little plain area, to the prairie. All right, so, and, uh, hey, Carno. Get him, guys. Come on, I want to see how you do. All right. Yeah, what? Oh, you want to mess with me? Yeah, dude, you didn't stand a chance, all right, buddy? Yeah. <laughs> that was decided right before the thing even started. All right, so, yeah, we're going to get over here. Um, see if we can find a couple beaver dams. Um, this is just the first spot I intend on f looking for. Or looking around and seeing what level of beavers there are around here. There's a raptor. And this raptor doesn't know what's going to hit him. Stupid raptor. Yeah, dude. Sure, you can bite me. 
Stop laughing. Eat him. There you go. Good job. <laughs> Stupid raptor. All right. Dillo's over there. And I should probably start taming me a few Dillo's. But I've been waiting until we uh, finally move the base. But after we move the base, I think the very next episode, we're probably going to start building the base. Because I've been procrastinating on that a little bit. But I want to make sure, you know, that um, I cover every last little bit that people need to know. And I think I've done that. I mean, we're we're in the process right now of segueing over into a... Uh, from the beginner's guide over into a Let's Play. Because, I mean... We're pretty well established right now. Well, not, you know, amazingly established. But we're, we're, you know, we're not established established, but we're established enough. Yeah. And that's what I'm going with. <laughs> All right, let's get over here. Is that you way over there? Yep. 95. Hey, that's not too bad. All right, well, let's go see what else we got. Here's another one. Where'd you go? Five. All right, you suck. All right. Let's see, what else over here? Hey, Mr. Piranhas. Any beavers in there? Yeah? No beavers? All right, fine. All right. Um, I'm going to go over to the next spot. Now that we know that there's a 95 there, that's pretty good. But I think I'm going to head down the island a little bit more. And then... How are you doing on... Wow, <laughs> you guys even gather fried meat. You guys are so awesome. Wow, you're almost up to uh, where I'm going to start pumping up your damage. That's good stuff. You still have a little bit um, to go, Cheech. All right, you're the little oddball. All right, so hey, I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna see you guys in a little bit because we're still gonna look. I'm not gonna commit to those guys yet. Uh, the 95 is uh, it interests me, but um, yeah. And then also when we uh, finally move, um, do move bases over to the other area, um, it'll be close enough to where we can go uh, tame up a mammoth, which should be pretty good. All right, all right. So hey, I'll I'm gonna head over there and I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, now we're at the next spot. Right over here by this big rock. And there's a beaver right over there. What level are you, buddy? I saw you for a sec. Where'd you go? There you are. 15. All right. That's not bad. All right. Chill out, guys. There's two beaver dams, so there's got to be more beavers around here. Prawn over there. Gotcha. All right. Come on, buddy. I'm going to pillage your dam, so I need you gone. Sorry, buddy. Yeah. Sorry, dude. Hyena pack. <laughs> you weren't expecting them, huh? All right. All right, let's see. I saw some prawn over there. All right, let's grab all this. This should make the rest of the beavers come around the area to us. Any more beavers? No? Yeah, there's a beaver. You're level 10. Alright, well... Get him, guys. <clears throat> Sorry, Mr. Beaver. But, um, yeah. Is there more in there? A piranha? <laughs> okay. Oh, let me jump over you. I'll, I'll kill the bloody piranha. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right, so yeah, Um, let me go get this other one over here. And then I think 
we're going to head inland a little bit because there's another spot where beavers spawn. And I'm really having a lot of fun with uh, the hyena pack and the equus and everything because it's so nice to actually just go out and not on just not on a flying mount it's so cool um and the fact that this is very very viable yeah it's a little bit more it, time consuming than uh oh just flying on an argent or a tronodon but you know it's it's so much more rewarding too it's really really cool all right get that guy come on buddies don't let the rock kick your butt cheek dude this is what you're over five on those rocks man Dude, it's a rock. It's a rock. Oh, and so you just jump right over the rock. All right, you let it kick your butt for a little bit, then you just jump right over it. Gotcha. All right, so hey, I'm going to head over to another spot, and you know, we're actually heading over close to uh, where I decided I was going to build the base. Come on, Chong. All right, so yeah, I might actually just swing up there and uh, take a look at the beavers up there as well. There's a bunch of beaver spawns over in that area. But it gets really dangerous over there as well, too. So, yeah. All right. So, hey, I will see you guys in a bit because I am having a great fun time with this adventure. It's really cool. All right. See you guys in a bit. And there's the green beacon in the distance. We've made it quite a, quite a ways. Um, I'm really, really enjoying the trip. This is just a ton of fun. I mean, these hyenas, oh, wow. They've leveled up quite a bit. Just, I mean, just eating everything that gets in our path. I mean, Spinos, Stegos, Baryonyxes, Raptors, Carnos, everything. It's so cool. Um, I mean, everything just vaporizes in front of them. I mean, so, a couple of them, you know, it takes them a few bites. And there was once where uh, um, a uh, Spino ran off into the wa deep water and it had problems going over. I'm not going to have problems with you Trudons, am I? All right, that's going to be an interesting fight if uh, I do. Oh, there's Raptor. All right, get him, guys. And more Raptors. All right. Get him. All right. <laughs> it's just so fun. I uh, mean, normally going through here with an Equus, I'd be like, oh, yeah, I need to... And Micro Raptors. Micro Raptors don't last long with a hyena pack around. Yeah, they hit you and they knock you off, but you don't really worry too much about it. It's just, hey, so there's 10 seconds of my life that uh, I'm just going to be standing still. All right. <laughs> and then down here, there's another area with a whole bunch of beavers. Ooh, a bear. Not very good. Let's see how the hyena pack fares against you. Get them, boys. Get them. All right. Come on, let's see. Didn't bring you guys this whole way just to see, you know, just to sit around, all right? This area is ours, guys. This is ours. We got to come in and move over and take it over because this is the area we're going to be moving into here soon. So, yeah. Come on, guys. Let's go this way. And see, right up here, this is where I plan on building. So, we made it pretty far, and I love the ambience or the ambiance of this area. The background noises that they added to it is so cool. All right, but there's a whole bunch of uh, beaver dams around here. So let's go take a look over here and see what ones we've got. There's beaver right here. What level are you, buddy? 20. Dude, are you for real? Just hyenas, I don't have time for his little nudging. Just get them. I'll get this beaver too. Alright, alright. We got this. Alright, come on. Oh, he's nudging you all away, huh? All right. Come on, Bud Spud. I guess it's on us. All right. All right. Now let's make sure these guys don't get stuck in the rock over here in the water. Come on, guys. All right. And then um, there should be a couple more beavers over there. There usually is. 
Let's go take a look. And the fog is rolling in, and I hate this stupid fog. Oh, hey, what level are you? 15. All right, all right, all right. All right, keep an eye on me, guys. Oh. Nice of you to join us, Cheech. All right. Let's get in here. Any more beavers? Oh, there's one. Let's see, nine. Forty. Okay. All right. Well, let's see. All right, I'm going to be looking around, and I will see you guys in a bit, because we're probably going to be heading up over towards where we're going to build. And I might actually start building a uh, little bit today, because, I mean, we need to uh, start getting a pretty big area going. All right, and I, I want the base this time to be really, really cool. So, all right, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet, but we're going to do it. And, yeah, all right, I will see you guys in a bit. All right, I waited out the morning and the fog, and so now we're gonna come up here. Let's see, what all do we have? And this right here, up here, this is the spot where I want to build, I think. Um, let's see. All right, sure thing, compies. Won't be the first ones I've killed. All right, what's with all the bugs? Something dead there? Oh, it's a mess up. Oh, you guys killed a foo! Oh, dude, not cool, guys. Not cool. Oh, there's a couple of these guys. What level are you? I'll take one of you guys if I uh, can't find a beaver. 25, 45. I won't take one of you guys if I can't find a beaver. Let's get over here. See, this is a nice flat spot right here. All right, let's get you dead. And we're gonna have some. Come on, get him! Get him! All right, there's one. There's two. All right. Now where's the dill? Oh, the dill is dead too. All right. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Let's uh over here. And this is a really, really good spot. Um, let's see. Is there a way down right here? Well, there kind of is. You hear that? That sounds really cool. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. All right. Um. Oh, is that a Spino over there? Well, we're gonna have to go find out. Oh, T-Rex, hey! Surprised I didn't see you. Oh, only 40. You're not cool. Maybe over on that one. See, so you guys with me? Yeah, let's go down this way. Get him. Oh, that was a tough one. All right, all right. We're going this way, guys. Come on, funnel you down through here. This is kind of cool. I like this area right here. That's neat. Right, down this way. What do we got over there? Just some parasaurs. And there should be some more beavers over here too. Hopefully. Trikes. Look. Beaver sign. Oh. Parasaur sign. Oh, hey. Beavers. What do we got? 90. Hey, not bad. Oh, hey, 125. I think we'll... And two beaver dams. Let's see. How am I going to do this? 
Because I like the 125. 125 is really good. And there's a bunch of berries around here, so... Alright, let's see. Get some stamina. All right, come on. Let's see if we can get this guy knocked out. All right, over here. Let's see. Come on. Come on. And you're out. All right. Now let's get out of the way so we're this other beaver. All right. And now that we're over here... Get him, guys. All right, get that guy, too. You look really cool, though. All right. So, hey, we've got this guy knocked out. That's pretty good. What kind of uh, stuff do I have in my inventory? Let's see. That, that. I don't need stim berries. And let's get rid of all this. Because I'm going to just go farm up a whole ton of narco berries. All right. Although I am going to get XP off this spoiled meat that I have as well. So, I'm going to get this guy starved up a bit. Before I stick some vegetables on him. But yeah, alright. So uh, when I get ready to stick a bunch of stuff on him, I will bring you guys back. Well, let's take a look at his pre-tame stats. Or her tame. It was a female, right? Alright, well, let's take a quick look. And Torpor's already going down really fast. Hey, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Alright. Alright. Alright, so I'm going to go uh, gather up a whole bunch of narco berries, and I will bring you guys back, alright? See you guys in a bit. Alright, I'm just waiting on this uh, beaver to get up. Uh, she got hit by a raptor, this guy right here. Um, and so I'm just going to let her get up, heal up a little bit, and then I'm going to knock her back out. Where are you up there? You're a turtle. Alright, keep on being a turtle, dude. Good job. All right, so now I'm just gathering a bunch of fiber. Maybe um, if before she gets up, I can put some uh, pillars around her or something. But who knows? All right, so uh, yeah, let's see. All right, that beaver didn't make it. Um, it just wouldn't heal up um, fast enough. But here is a... Where are... Get back. Dude, stop. <laughs> 110. Not as good as the 125, but it'll have to do. All right, let's... All right, come on. All right, but, I mean, this right here was a really good spot so far for beavers. But there was a 90, a 110, and a 125, which is really, really cool. No, 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 no. But Spud, where are you going? Dude! Come on, Butt Spud. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. Let's get you knocked out, buddy. Ah, it's been a frustrating day with the beavers. I want to go slow here, because when he starts running, I want to be right on top of it. Get a little bit of stamina here. There we go. All right, come on, buddy. No, stop pooping. And he's out. All right. And this is a decent spot, I guess. Um, let's put you guys over here. All right. That's a decent spot. Um, yeah, I've had T-Rexes already come down over there. Um, so, uh, yeah. But T-Rexes, Raptors, all sorts of stuff have been coming down. But I'm just going to keep grabbing a bunch of Narco Berries. I'm going to let this guy starve out again. Just like the other one. Hopefully a Raptor doesn't come up and start eating on it. 
Ah, hopefully. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna get this guy tamed up and I will see you guys in a bit. All right, the beaver's taming. I've just, I put a pen around it so where, uh, in case something comes up, I have a little bit of uh, early warning and uh, these guys right here, as they're trying to defend it, won't uh, start beating up the beaver. And also, uh, this guy right here, a little Microraptor, decided he was going to come up and start whacking on me. So I knocked him out with the horse and uh, tamed him up with a couple rare flowers. All right, but now, while that's going on, I'm going to run over here really quick. And I'm going to take a look at the top of that hill over there. All right. Um, because um, I'm really interested in that. Let's see. Where's the path back up? I know I found it earlier. Is this it? Uh, yeah. Okay, kind of. Maybe. Alright. It's also the beauty part about horses. They can go up really steep slopes. It's really cool. Alright, what's this? I like this spot. This spot's pretty cool. Wow. Can I jump up there? There we go. Now let's get over here. Are you getting beat up over there, buddy? Are you bloody or are you just always that color? Oh, you're just always that color. Okay. Couple Brontos. And that's Giga Mountain, right? Yeah? Hope there's no Gigas on it today. All right, and I think, oh, there's something over there. There's something over there. All right, we're going to have to go take a look and see what that is. Um, but yeah, um, also I built a, I think we might actually incorporate this waterfall, maybe incorporate the waterfall into the build, but I'm thinking about those over there. We could go with like a three-tier structure. That's pretty cool. I like that idea. Um, and then we can look at the waterfall this time instead of just having it behind us. That would be pretty neat. All right, so let's get over here. And also, I already went up and built a uh, refining or yeah, refining forge and a uh, oh foundation to put it on. And also, I think yeah, I think I'm going to uh, go over on this this side right here just in case if we get the occasional giga that comes down. Um, he has to go through this area over here. Before he can just, you know, pound down the walls like, me want flinger. Yeah. So uh, let me take a look at this guy's torpor real fast. That's a dillo I killed. All right, let's see. Your torpor's doing all right. And let's see. Let's give you another 100 narco berries. So 100 narco berries is 750. Oh, crap. All right, accidentally fed him uh, potatoes. All right, I need those potatoes. All right, so while he's uh, still unconscious, let's run up here. I want to take a look. I think I'm going to put the refining forge over on this side, right up here for now, right by this dillo. Oh, really? Are you for real? Can I move? Thanks? Really? Stupid Microraptor. Alright. You female? No, you're male. Alright, you can die. Alright. Alright, let's get this guy uh, dead, and then we'll move... Over here, I want to uh, put the refining forge right here for now. And this right here is going to be the beginning of our new base. Right like this. Let's see, how do we want it? I'll probably end up changing it later, but let's see. Let's see. Um, I want it like this. So where... Well, hold on. No, I want it to where I can eventually build up there and it'll be all one structure. So, let's see. There we go. All right. And then let's put this up here. And then we got to go get a bunch of metal so we can start getting a smithy going. All right.
Because I didn't think ahead and bring any metal with me. So, hey. Alright. So, yep. Uh, do you have any metal on you, Butt Spud? You don't. Alright, alright, alright. Well, hey, I'm gonna finish doing this and I will bring you guys back. Um, yeah, see you guys in a bit. Alright, she's gonna be getting up here in just a second. And, wow, this has been... There she goes. Alright, this has been a long time. Um, and I'm just gonna call her B. The Builder... Beaver. All right, because Bob would be weird, right? So this is B. All right. <laughs> so yeah. And then um, now, um, let me see. I'm just gonna leave her in there for now. I think. Um, I think she's safe for the most part. And I was able to run up here and let me show you. Um, I put up just a couple foundations. What are you doing up here, buddy? All right, you might want to get out of here. Yeah, and I put up a smithy, uh, um, refining forge. I'm probably going to build a couple more refining forges, but I think I'm going to build them up there. Because up there is where a whole ton of metal is, and I need to figure out a way of getting an Anki up there eventually. Now, right now, I think I'm going to end up building a bridge over there. I mean, I have plans for all sorts of little bits and pieces in this area. Should be pretty cool. At least I hope it is. All right. But yeah, I mean, it's been a long day, been a long journey, and I think this this is going to do it for the episode. I mean, uh, we're ending on a cliffhanger. Bum, bum, bum. Will Flinger make it? Will he be able to get all this stuff moved over? We don't know. Tune in tomorrow. All right. So yeah. Wow. Um, so we've got uh, the hyenas over here. We've got new Be the Builder Beaver, which I don't have enough metal to build her saddle, or else I would have already had the saddle built for her, because that's why I built the um, smithy. So Be the Builder Beaver, she's not going to be able to have a saddle for now, um, until I can go over and I can get Super Dodo, and then I can get up top of there and harvest a whole bunch of metal. Yeah. So I'm going to have to do that, but until then, I think, uh, yeah, until then, if you like the episode, click that like button. I really appreciate that. And until next time, this is Flinger Foo. And take it easy, everyone. Oh, it's been a busy day. And we're not, we're still in the thick of it. All right, Whoopi, Cheech, Chong? Yeah, you guys are going to have to guard Be the Builder Beaver while I go over and I get Super Dodo. Yeah, that's going to have to be a thing. I don't know if you guys are going to make it. All right. But hey, take it easy, everyone.